Gang, gang, what's poppin', man? Welcome back to Let's Talk Everything Podcast. Y'all already know what's up with me. I am the host, Carnage Slaughter, and this is the spot where we hold empowering conversations for entrepreneurial minds, gang. You feel me? So everybody hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let me get y'all an introduction right away. Man, you bitch niggas better end your butt elevate. I need six figure money, won't have the bucks and hella cake. Fuck boy, I've been on dummy, shooting hella ops, make them a day. If not him, then kill his mama, make him feel his wrath in the hell away. Hydro shock, but it's all in through his chest, watch as they swim away. I don't stop shooting till you die and your last breath, and then I skid away. This a hollow tip. Gang, gang, what's poppin', man? Look, hey, look, y'all see the title, right? That's the title, man. How to dodge the haters and refuse the fate. Well, um, you got to be able to do that yourself. You know what I'm saying? That ain't something nobody could teach you. There's so many ways and, and, and there's so many scenarios that you can dodge in life. You know what I'm saying? But it takes discipline. Uh, it takes you to be courageous and it takes you to understand yourself and what you going to sit up for and what you ain't going to put up with. You know what I'm saying? Um, <clears throat> and uh, forgive me, man. I'm a little bit under the weather, but I still got to drop. Y'all know that. But at the end of the day, man, you know, it's it's... It's hard to understand who hating on you and who ain't hating on you. It's hard to understand or peep who fake with you and who ain't faking with you. Who got your back, who ain't got your back. You know what I'm saying? Who got your best interest at heart and who ain't. Um, <clears throat> a lot of times, a lot of us, gang, we we tend to, uh, we fuck off good relationships that we got with good people. You know what I'm saying? I know that. I'm going to keep witness to that. We fuck off good relationships that we got with good people because we tend to bump our heads so many times, gang, not knowing what we're doing, where we're going. You feel me on this path, on this road that we chasing. You feel me? Sometimes we be thinking the grass green on the other side, trying to burn bridges with motherfuckers that we really fuck with that can help us get the jobs, help us, you feel me, uh, uh, land some money, help us land a gig, whatever the case may be for you. You know how it go. Um, But at the end of the day, it's like, gang, you got to dodge the haters. There's certain people that don't want to see you where you at right now. There's certain people that don't like the fact that you made it and achieved this much. You know what I'm talking about? Certain people, they don't want to see you achieving anything right now, my nigga. Or if you're a boss lady out there, certain women out there, certain men out there too that don't want to see you achieve anything, miss. You feel me? They don't want to see you doing anything, baby girl. The only thing you got to do is stay down, though, for your come up. See, a lot of times people can't see our come ups because it ain't meant for them to see your come up, gang. And I said this last year, gang. It ain't meant for nobody to see your come up. They're going to they gonna judge you. They're going to talk about you, gang. They're going to hop all over your bandwagon at some point in time because they see you doing good. You feel me? They see you, you know, you vibing right. And they're going to keep checking back and forth in your business. That's when you know you got a nosy motherfucker. They're going to keep checking back and forth in your business, gang. They're going to keep making sure that your business ain't your business, but your business is their business and show business. When your business ain't show business, this shit don't run like no motherfucking circus show around this bitch. You know what I'm saying? You got to let them know that, though. So you got to start stamping your your way and your, your, your improvement of <clears throat> sincereness, you feel me, and dedicatedness and, and standing on businessness, not what T.I. Son was doing. Shout out to T.I. Son. But at the end of the day, gang, you got to really be standing on your business. You know what I'm saying? Campaigning for what you campaigning for because a lot of motherfuckers don't understand you out here. And another thing, too, cut the traffic that you're running with. Cut the people that you're running with. Some of the people you're running with, gang, right now, man and woman, some of the people you're fucking with is no good for you, my nigga. You need to X them out. You feel me? You need to X them out. I, ha I heard a young lady today. I'm at the auto parts store, gang. Her daughter said, Mama, I drew a knife. Right here, so you can stab my dad. You know what I'm saying? He said he's gonna shoot you in the face. You feel me? I'm like, damn, the little girl no no more than three years old. You know what I'm saying? But it's crazy because the kids can say that. You know what I'm saying? So that's a hater for the mama. The mama needs to dodge the hater. The kid love the hell out the mom. You can tell because the kid, like, yeah, you know, if you don't do it, I'll do it. She the kid wanted to protect her mom. And that that right there is sincere. You feel me? That's sincere at the heart. And that's a baby. <clears throat> but at the end of the day, you know, we be like that out here, too. We be like that out here, my nigga. You got to be sincere in your heart that you alleviating these haters out your life, that you, you know what I'm saying, disassociating yourself with these faking ass people out here, gang. Because it's a lot of motherfuckers out here that's faking. You don't know nothing about them until you run across them or until you have that moment with them, until they show that color, gang. You won't, you ain't going to know shit about it until that, that, you know what I'm saying, they come out of them. But a lot of times, gang, we got to be ready for it. Prepare for it. You feel me? Don't put nothing past nobody. I don't give a fuck who they is. Don't put nothing past them because you already know they could take you there. They could take it there. You could take them there. You know what I'm saying? Either way it goes, it's going to be a bad situation. And nine times out of ten, you know them want a bad situation. 
<laughs> but <clears throat> some people don't give a fuck about a bad situation. Yeah, some people they here for drama. Some people only live for bullshit. They live for negativity. You know, I hate a motherfucker who live for negativity. You know, let me take that back. I don't hate a person like that. I'm disgusted with a person who only live for negativity. Gang, like, how's we doing anything positive to prosper if you only living for negativity? That ain't what I want to live for. I want to live to make sure I'm able to take care of my kids, leave some money behind, own a few businesses, own some land. You feel me? Start a few companies here and there. You feel me? Generate a, a lot of money, uh, pass a few funds across countries and everything else. Like, gang, that's what I want to live to do. I don't know what y'all niggas be planning to do or, you, you know, what's your plot to live. But at the end of the day, me personally, I want to live a little. I want to do a lot. You know what I'm saying? I want to do a lot. I want to live a little, but some of you niggas out here, we can't tell y'all want to live. Y'all killing each other, killing your baby mamas, killing the kids, like senseless, senseless crimes, senseless murders, man. Senseless, heinous crimes and heinous murders. I don't understand people. They hit that motherfucking like button, that share button, subscribe to the fucking channel and comment. A lot of this shit out here, you know, they say is meant to be. It's meant to happen the way it is to keep people distracted, distorted, to keep people lost in the sauce, to keep people not achieving or getting to where they need to be in life. You feel me? But me personally, I ain't never been one of them people to get distracted along my journey. You know what I'm saying? You can't get distracted along your journey. I don't give a fuck if you, you like, come on, gang. If you really want to get there and that's where you want to be, my nigga, you're going to make sure you get there. If that's what you really want out of life, a person's going to make sure they go get what they want out of life. They're not going to sit here and play around with that shit. You feel me? We see too many young niggas and young bitches. You feel me? Excuse my French, but young niggas and young bitches out there, they just trying to get the microwavable style of life. That ain't it. You got to think longevity. You got you to gotta put your time in it. You got to survive, my nigga, to be able to earn something and to be able to say, hey, yo, I did this. You see, right now, motherfuckers get a lot of money right now and they think they the shit. You feel me? Y'all know how it go. It's just like tax time. When tax time come around, these people get to the thinking they the shit out here. But at the end of the day, it's like, is you really the shit? Is you really that person? Some people really ain't that person. Sometimes they faking the fun. And you got to see it, but they don't mean judge them by it. <clears throat> Help their ass out. Help them stop faking the fun. Help them along the way. Help them become some, you know, body better, you know, on a level of self that they ever been. You know, help them. Show them the way, my nigga. Some people don't want to show nobody shit. That's sad. That's why you ain't going to ever get shit. That's the point. See, you ain't going to ever share nothing or show nobody nothing, gang. What you think you're going to receive out here? Ain't nobody fucking with you. What you mean? You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody going to fuck with you. Ain't nobody rocking with you. None of that shit. Ain't nobody putting together nothing with you. You know? Um. At the end of the day, I feel like all of us can achieve, gang. All of us can dream and achieve. You know, but it takes for other folks out here in the world to give us a chance. It takes for other people out there to give everybody a chance, a fighting chance, not just a chance, a fighting chance. You feel me? Because it takes a fighting chance to be able to run a company, own a business, you know, whether it's a label, whether it's a Walmart, Walgreens, it takes a chance. So I already know how they go. And it takes strength and it takes courage and it takes intuition and it takes belief. It takes faith. It takes you. It takes you to put in work. You know what I'm saying? Your physical self. You know, like at the end of the day, though, man, like y'all just keep your head up, stay focused, dodge the haters and the, uh, the fake people refuse the fakeness. A lot of fake shit gang, it come around. You know what I'm saying? A lot of fake shit come around often and fast, but you got to learn how to, you know, what I'm karate chop. You got to get that shit off you gang. Fuck all that. You got, you know what I'm saying? Karate chop that shit. You feel me? Stiff bows on my mama. At the end of the day, though, I love y'all, man. Y'all make sure y'all take care. Stay safe. Stay out the way. Uh, stay dodging the haters, man. Stay out the, the fake people way. You feel me? Don't let them perpetrate on you. I love y'all. I am gone. Gang, look, I thank everybody for stopping at Let's Talk Everything podcast, man, where we having powerful conversations for entrepreneurial minds, gang. Look, make sure y'all hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And for sure, make sure you share this video, gang, for every entrepreneur out there that's trying to come up, that's trying to be a business owner, or even if you're just trying to support your boy, man. You feel me? I definitely appreciate y'all, man. Y'all stay safe, stay out the way, stay blessed, stay positive, and stay grinding, man. I'm out.